Well, every single one of the answers I've lived through. And the unfortunate thing of my life, I guess, is that um, uh, I have found uh, too many people uh, who have um, abused me in one way or another, whether it's by the tongue or, or by um, just uh, being mean. Uh, and, uh, and it's been a hard life. And I've actually put it down in a book. Uh, it's called The Answer to Sun Tzu. I use Sun Tzu as the character, uh, as a warrior, and I guess because I feel that I have been at war. And um, I think that, as, uh, as I said before, the, we are at war because we are not at peace with each other and we are not happy as a result of not being at peace with each other. So the lessons that are written down in the book are, are really because the ego exists. If the ego doesn't exist, perhaps the lessons wouldn't exist. They wouldn't, there would be no need because everyone would be happy and they would be kind and they would be generous and they would be loving and they would be helpful and there would, there would not me be any any reason to write such a book. I, actually, I wouldn't have any reason to write either book. But since there is an ego that people need to go to war against within themselves and if within their uh, partners and within their family units and within their jobs and within their uh, communities, then they, the soul needs to have this training. And that is what I'm writing about. I'm writing soul training so that whatever experience comes your way, that you can use this book as a reference book and go in there and get some inspiration of how you should treat the situation in which you find yourself and how you should actually treat someone whose ego is abusing you.